Oh, and as well, right here is where I do all my editing of videos. So this is going to be my little office. My wife's office will be right below me. Um, but yeah, we're going to be doing, that's where I put all these videos together and where I do all my work that I need to do. Uh, nothing fancy, but yeah, we're not going to do anything there other than making it kind of just painting it and doing them you know, functional with probably some LED lights in the ceilings and that kind of thing. So towards the back of the house and the gardens there, I can't open that window or I would show you. Um, but basically we're using this to store a lot of the beds that we already have. There's nothing wrong with them. So we've got nowhere to put them and no bedrooms really that need them because we can't, we're not having guests over. So there's a weird oil thing heater here that we're going to get rid of. Um, and that also leads to the trap door up there that goes to the pigeon area that I was talking about before. Um, yeah. And then the other thing we're going to plan to do back here is going to put a spiral staircase that goes up to the pigeon area eventually. We'll see how that works. And then we're going to make this whole section here uh, bookshelves and possibly with a kind of a hidden automated door or something that comes out or slides that will allow us into this room. So we have a bookshelf in front of it. So it's kind of like a fun little, you know, you pull the book and the door slides or something like that. And I haven't figured out yet. It's kind of far down the road, but I'm going to have fun with doing stuff like that. And this will be the games room slash guest bedroom for kids or something. I'm not sure. Let's go take a look. Yeah, so we're going to have this as kind of the games room. I'm thinking of putting either a TV on this wall, pull-out couch, or some sort of futon-y thing that you can sit on, and that we can sit here and play video games with and look out the windows. Once again, I can't open this one because the shutter will fall off. Uh, it's nice that we have a lot of cupboards along back here um, that we're going to put filled with, you know, DVDs or music or whatever we want to do in here uh, to store stuff. And uh, yeah, it's, there's a lot of water damage in this room. Uh, this room was absolutely crazy. It was a really dark hunter green kind of wallpaper with blue flowers on it. And it was so dark. It also had a blue uh, linoleum kind of floor in here and it smelled really weird. Well, kind of like medicine or something. I don't know how to explain it, but medicine is the best description I could give you. And it, they wallpapered all the way up into the ceiling, the same wallpaper everywhere. It was the darkest room in the house. I mean, yeah, I know the the shutter's closed, but it's so much brighter here than it was. And they wallpapered all these doors. It was just crazy. So we're going to brighten it up, redo all the plaster. Well, not redo it, but, you know, fix all the plaster in here, give it a nice paint and uh, not to go too crazy in here. Yeah, maybe put a uh, chandelier or something in there, but nothing too crazy. Just if we find something that's an antique or something, we'll throw it back in. Uh, yeah, we may or may not keep these lights. We're not sure yet. Uh, and yeah, it, basically because it gives us some of the best views in the whole house out here and then on the, the small bedroom that's on the other side, which I'll show you next.